In today's video, we'll take a look at Bryson Deschambeau's physical makeover. The numerous parts of this man's regimen that we'll look at today include gaining healthy muscle weight, workouts, appropriate food and diet, and much more. So let's get started. The beginning of a successful transformation. Bryson Deschambeau is one of the few sportsmen who has gone through such a dramatic physical transformation in such a short period of time. The American golfer decided to change his game radically by bulking up in order to obtain the muscle he needs to reach longer distances on the course. During the first lockdown, Deschambeau put in a lot of time at the gym and followed a diet that saw him gain 45 pounds on a 6,000 calorie per day diet. And it's paid off for Deschambeau, who now frequently hits longer drives than anyone else on the PGA Tour. The 2020 US Open champion consumes fewer calories than he did previously, but still consumes roughly 3,500 calories per day. His grab it and rip it approach has made him a fan favorite. Deschambeau claims he wants to live until he's 130 years old, and he swings out of his shoes on nearly even drive. Going to the gym, he claims, has helped him improve his club swinging speed. He's so good that all he needs is a 5.5 degree loft driver, which is only 1.5 degrees higher than most putters. Justin Rose was one of the many people who noticed the significant change. When questioned about his experience playing with Deschambeau, the 2013 US Open champion said, He's a huge man. I trailed him by 40 yards. Inspiring words by Bryson Deschambeau. Deschambeau admits, quote, I started trying to get stronger eight months earlier because I feel I can get an advantage. What if, like Happy Gilmore or Kyle Berkshire, I could hit it straight over 400 yards? This is a major advantage, so that's what I set out to do. And as a result, I've gotten healthier and stronger as a result. Deschambeau was aware that increasing his strength would help him improve his drive speed and length. But it wasn't his primary focus. The training during the preceding eight months had also been targeted at longer-term lifestyle adjustment. He followed Roscoff's recommendations to the letter, isolating and training every muscle in his body. He guffaws right down to the fingertips. Regardless of the weather, this involves working out every evening. He maintains that he doesn't take rest days because all he needs to recuperate is a good night's sleep. If I exercise in the mornings, I wouldn't be able to play golf for the entire day, he adds. In the morning, I go golfing, and in the evening, I calculate to relieve any aches and pains. I'll get out of bed in the morning without feeling stiff, he says. Because my back compensated for my abs, I used to despise getting out of bed in the morning. As a result, I was given a new lease in life when I began properly training my body. Workout regimen that worked wonders. Bryson's exercise routine is fascinating to see, since in addition to being a golfer, he's also a skilled bodybuilder. Bryson's body goes through a variety of exercises during his training. His routine has been mentioned in a variety of interviews. Most recently, he was included in a video interview for the Dick's Pros Tips in which he revealed his routine freely. Bryson stated in the interview that he prefers to execute solo motions and doesn't engage in complex workouts. He's afraid of complex motions and believes that training a big number of muscles at the same time may harm his body. As a result, he assists himself by focusing on one body component at a time. His favorite sport, golf, is also beneficial to him. Does Bryson work out on a daily basis? Yeah, that's right. It's every single day, regardless of the circumstances. Unlike other individuals, he doesn't take holidays. As he stopped doing things, his body grew less capable of managing them. In his position, it functions as both a rest and a training mechanism. He believes that this is his body's way of telling him that this is the force he should exert. If he sits and doesn't move for a few days, Bryson feels the gravity is pulling his body downward all of a sudden. He would then be unable to handle all of the force he's currently exerting, and so he doesn't take a break. People have different reactions and experiences with therapies like massage, which can be both spectacular and dreadful, but Bryson doesn't prefer them and is therefore not treated by a physical therapist or a massage therapist. When he tried deep tissue massage and other therapies like stone or oil massage, he stated that he felt worse when he got off the table than when he got on. Definite Isolation Training of the Man each body part is isolated one at a time. If you're not familiar with it, it's a sort of workout of which you focus on one body part at a time. As a result, exercises such as deadlifts, stiff leg deadlifts, branch presses, snatching, overhead squats, and others are undervalued. Rowing, bicep isolation curls, and other isolation equipment are commonly mentioned. In addition to jogging, Bryson does a lot of core workouts in the evenings after golf. He returns to training right away after a brief break. Last year, Bryson Deschambeau gained 20 pounds of muscle, culminating a spectacular physical transformation. While gaining weight, the 2020 US Open champion worked out with Greg Griskov, 
at Muscle Activation Techniques or MAT. The two have worked together over the past two years on techniques to improve strength through improved mobility. DeShembo had dedicated more time in the gym to developing symmetrical core strength through exercises such as trunk rotation, trunk flexion, leg flexion, back extension, and side bending. He also gave up coffee and began drinking protein shakes seven times a day. Leg curls and extensions, hip reductions and abductions, and standing hamstring kickbacks were among the exercises he performed. He did pull-ups on a fingerboard he built himself, attached to a wooden fence. On the other side, the golfer didn't lift a single free weight. As another bodyweight strengthening exercise, he did handstand dips against a wall. The crazy carb and protein diet of 6,000 calories. Bryson has tried a variety of diets, including the keto diet at one point, but none of them have worked for him. He's been on a 2 is to 1 carbohydrate to protein diet for a long time. He has no fat storage space in his body because he walks 8 miles a day, so all of the nutrients are absorbed. He hasn't gained any weight despite walking 8 miles every day. To maintain his muscular build, the four-time national champion consumes a variety of hearty meals and supplements with protein shakes. Breakfast consists of 4 eggs, 5 slices of bacon, toast, and 2 protein shakes. He heads to the golf field for some practice as soon as he finishes his breakfast. During that period, he also consumes several macro bars, peanut butter sandwiches, and three protein smoothies. He has a snack and drinks another protein shake after golf. Steak, potatoes, and other protein shake make up a normal supper. Calorie counting is not part of the Shambo diet. When you add it all up, you're looking at somewhere between 3,000 and 3,500 calories. It's usually around 6.30 p.m. by the time he finishes working out. Carbohydrates and protein are normally distributed two is to one at dinner. He doesn't eat a lot of grains, which is unusual. He has garnered no true benefits as a result of it. He has had blood tests in the past, and they've always turned out to be normal. He includes a lot of carbohydrates and proteins in his diet. During his time on the keto diet, he lost a lot of weight and physical strength. While some people may be forced to take that path, he didn't believe it was the best option for him. It's impossible to complete tasks in the same exact way every time. He prefers rice or potatoes with the occasional serving of vegetables. Following that, steak or chicken would be on the menu. Seafood isn't high on this priorities list. Bryson doesn't only consume two large meals per day. We're guessing he eats a range of things and drinks perhaps six or seven protein shakes per day. He also maintains a supply of protein bars in hand in case he requires a couple. A pinch of sugar or a nibble here and there will be sufficient for him. At some point in your life, you must have some fun. It's also important to not strictly follow DeChambeau's routine and diet to achieve your physique goals. The amount of energy required is determined by an individual's weight, activity level, and genetic makeup. The video for today draws to a close with all of that. What are your thoughts on the impressive workout routine and the strict diet of DeChambeau? Comment below. Before you leave, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and press the bell icon. Stay tuned. Goodbye.